Good day, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to my humble home, my casa, my hacienda here in Livingston, Montana. Okay, today's date is February 7th of 2022. Now, this is the third time I've tried to make this video, and I hope to hell that I get it right this time, because my patience gets thin, you know what I mean? Okay, now, the last, yesterday I made a couple of videos concerning this this. Chrome, this Galaxy, this Samsung Galaxy Chromebook 2, and that, that camera there, and this microphone, and exhorted peripherals, et cetera, et cetera. The last couple of days, I've been working on this mobile Linux system. Okay, but there was a few things I just wanted to reiterate or straighten out, if for no other reason, for my own good, okay? Okay, like I've said in the last past videos right here, this is a Samsung Galaxy Chromebook 2, it, the, the Chrome operating system that it's running on is number 97.XXXXX, and the build name is called Night Fairy. It's a Linux beta operating system. Okay, now let's just say you've got this little box right here, and you're going to plug in a web camera, or you're going to plug in you know, an external mic, an external web camera, external mic, other than what, you know, this hardware here itself uses on board. Okay. Chances are your camera, your mic, or whatever have you is not going to show up in your app launcher. Chances are it's not going to show up on your desktop. Chances are it's not going to show up anywhere except for here. Open up your browser. Okay. Open up Chrome. And then go up to the upper right-hand side of the screen. You'll see three dots in a row, in, in, you know, vertical. Just click on that and navigate on down to settings. Hit settings. Let me see where I'm at here. <laughs> Hit settings. And then go to security and privacy. Okay. And then click into there and go to permissions. And from there... If this operating system is recognizing your your mic and your camera, you will see it there in that area that I just named off. Let me go over that again. Uh, Google Chrome slash settings slash security and privacy slash permissions. But from there, pick out your camera, highlight it, and pick out your microphone and make sure it's activated, recognized right there, okay? I'm just saying this to help you out, you know, because, you know, you might, you know, plug your camera in or a microphone in and go, that's what happened to me. I go, oh, this, none of this crap's working. You know, I didn't find any indication until I watched somebody else's YouTube video. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay, your audio controls and stuff like that, as you probably already know, lower right-hand side of your screen in the notification area. Okay. And also, you flip that page around with one of them flip around arrows, and that's how you turn your mic up and down. That's one place. There's another place, too. But, you know, we'll get onto that a little bit later. Okay. Uh, let me see here. Okay. Now, getting on, that's what I wanted to say mostly about how you access your camera or recognize it, or I did at this microphone. But getting onto this software that I'm using. I'm using this stuff called Screencastify. S-C-R-E-E-N-S-A or C-A-S-T-I-F-Y. Just like it sounds. Screencastify. But it's all in one word and don't try to type it out if you have spell correction <laughs> turned on because you'll you get bounced. Uh, your, your letters will get scrambled all over the place. Trust me, I know. But anyway, this particular, if, you, if you're if you interested in this software, what I didn't make clear yesterday is it's freeware or trialware, but, you're, but the, the software is limited, especially on time. You can only make five-minute videos, okay? You can only make five-minute videos. I I think that you can... You can only save videos that are up to five minutes. They got you crippled that way. They got you crippled several other ways until, unless you want to pay for this. But it is freeware, but it's limited freeware, okay? I wanted to make sure I got that. But when if you get into this Screencastify and you install it, 
where it's going to, okay, what this stuff technically is, it's in a browser extension. It's an extension of Chrome, the browser. Okay. And where it's going to, the, the, where the activation button is going to be at is right up in your browser's address bar, right to the very right of that little star. You know, where you mark your favorites for your bookmarks and all that. There's going to be an arrow a right-facing little arrow right there. And that's where you turn this software on. That's where you configure it from. And from right there, that little tab drop-down menu, you can record your desktop, the tab that you're in. You can use a web, the webcam function like what I'm doing right now and looking like an idiot because I'm doing all that theoretical crap. You know what I mean? I'm bound to determine, ladies and gentlemen, to get through this video. It's the last thing I do. Okay, Castify, but that's where it shows up. Browser, right-hand side of your address bar. Okay, and let me see. And it is payware. There's three pieces of software that you can... It's There's three pieces of software that are bundled in Screen Castify, okay? You've got... Uh, personally, myself, I, I, I bought the recording part of the software... Number two, I bought the editing part of the software. And number three, there's like a classroom or a submit or something where you do like projects and submit them to a, like a virtual classroom. I don't know. I looked into it, but I decided, no, this isn't for me. You know, I'm at 70 years old. I'm too old to be in a classroom. I've got a classroom with Jim Bourne, which is nothing but a horror story when it comes to this digital stuff, okay? <laughs> but anyway, so I... The bottom line is, is I just bought into the, you know, like I say, the, the recorder, the editor, and like that, and it cost me $58. I think that's for one year. Now, whether they're going to keep these prices the way they are, I don't know. But yesterday they had a deal going. I don't know how long this is going to last, but for 49 bucks, you could have bought the whole bundle of software. And by the way, while I'm thinking about it, no, I do not sponsor you know, screen uh, uh, castify. I don't work for screen castify. Those people don't even know me. So there you are with all that. You know, this is a standalone video. Like up to this point in time, all my videos have been free. I've been non sponsored and all that other stuff, you know. But I probably should be. You know, YouTube has indicated that I'm in line for all that monetization stuff might as well throw that in to make this video even more boring yet but i have to give that some thought yeah you know let me see okay uh yeah and also when you first pull on that arrow when you click on that arrow in your browser it'll drop down you you'll see three things that wanted it'll want you to know if, it'll want to know if you're going to record on your desktop uh, you record a, a, an internet browser tab, being in Chrome, or your webcam. And like right now, of course, I've got the webcam, which is a, I've got a, an old, outdated Logitech C920. And this microphone that I've got right here, I keep forgetting what the, but this guy right here is a Sure. There we go. It's a model MB5, a Sure. Okay. Well, where am I at here? Okay, good. I'm less than nine minutes. I'm liking that. You know what I mean? I like to keep these videos short. That's really all about all I had to say. I hope I hope I got it all what I wanted to say in this movie file so I could move on with my life. Ladies and gentlemen, take care of yourselves. We shall see you on down the trail, and adios, my friends.